started um, working in hospitality when I was 16 years old, pouring pints in the local pub. It was literally a stone's throw from our parents' house. Since then I went over to um, Leeds, studied so contemporary art, and then that's where I really fell in love with the industry. I started working in uh, Jake's Bar with uh, Ricardo Dine and Jake Berger some time ago, and that's when I really never looked back. I was honoured to receive the Altos Bartender's Bartender Award. I'd certainly describe it as one of the high points of my career. I was over in Singapore for coming up to three years and the Tipling Club was a high-end uh, fine dining restaurant. We spent a lot of time working on there was our cocktail menus. We developed the sensorium menu, being able to you know, work alongside such incredible talented chefs like Ryan and, and Ayo that it was a very eye-opening experience and completely opened up a different thought process of how to think about cocktails. We both followed our heart. I think Joe's led him to Singapore, mine took me to Paris and then to London. I think we work together very well. We finish our drinks, it's, there's a nice natural rhythm to it as well, and I think people really buy into that. For me, he's an inspiration. He's probably the main reason why I got into this industry in the first place, and I'm very excited to learn from him and continue learning. It feels great to be back in Manchester to open our own bar. Both me and my brother both love the city and we're very excited to be calling this place home once again. A writer once said that Manchester is a city that thinks the table is for dancing on. We've got a very clear vision of what we both want the bar to be like. Our key focus is to make sure that we've got happy guests and that's always been the most important thing for us.